Hello everyone, I'm Lynn Blasey. We're here um, to share with you some information about the Hamtramck Area Disaster Recovery Group. Um, I am a founder and the chair of the Hamtramck Area Disaster Recovery Group. And this is Catherine. Hi everyone. Um, I'm a case manager with the Society of St. Vincent de Paul. Um, and these are my team members, Cheryl and Irma, who are also case managers. We are based out of Hamtramck and um, we are yeah, excited to just connect with you guys and be resources um, in recovering from lasting effects of the June 26th, 25th and 26th, um, 2021 flood. Um, so the best way that you can get help to recover from that flooding um, disaster is to connect with one of us disaster case managers um, so we can open a case on your behalf. We are located at 3048 Kniff Street. Um, so that's between Gallagher and Camp Campo, right? Joseph Campo. Mm -hmm. Joseph Campo. And um, our office is open Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So feel free to come and pay us a visit. Hi, I'm Cheryl McCoy. I am one of the disasters ca disaster case managers in Hamtramck. Um, to explain some of the process of assisting you with um, any of your remaining unmet needs related to the disaster, um, we ask that we do a either phone conversation with you at first or an in-person um, conversation where we can go over the releases of information, provide you with um, you know, your part and our part as far as uh, what the disaster case manager does and also what you as the survivor does. Um, once we go over all of that, we discuss um, what happened on the event, what remaining repairs or things that you might still be in need of because you did not have the resources to um, either replace them or repair it. And then we work with a construction cost analyst and other um, our contractors within the community to be able to provide those estimates of the remaining work. And then us as case managers, we go to the fund funders that um, have the available money to ask them for those funds to be distributed um, for those survivors or for yourself, as a matter of fact. So the process is a little lengthy. Um, it is an involving process as we're just getting our feet on the ground here in Hamtramck. And we do ask for some patience, but we mm -hmm. um, can um, still assist you with some of the things that you are um, still in need of or if you're still experiencing some of the flooding um, residuals because you weren't able to have your home repaired. Um, but we also address other things that you might need um, anywhere from financial, uh, classes to assistance with utilities. We also work with um, identifying any other resources that you might have discussed with us during our time that we serve you. So that's a little bit of a wrap up on how the process works. Um, here's Irma to talk about our open house and our upcoming um, ribbon cutting. Hi. My name is Irma Hayes, and if you want to know more about what we do as disaster case managers, we invite you to come out to 3048 Kniff uh, on May the 19th, which is on Friday, where we're going to have our open house um, and ribbon cutting ceremony at 10 a.m. in the morning. And um, partake with us, get to know us, learn more about the programs and what we can offer to help you with. And if you miss it on Friday, you're always welcome to come on Saturday where we have Gordon Foods providing us with ice cream. Yeah. So we're having an ice cream social that begins at 12 noon. So we're looking forward to seeing you. And um, again, on behalf of all of us, we want to say thank you, Lynn, for having oh, us yeah, thanks, <laughs> here and talking about what we do as a community for our community. Awesome. Thank you all for being here. And we hope to see you on the 19th or 20th.